Hi guys, welcome to another video here at WWE 2K23 My Rise, and here we're doing Legacy Storyline, and let's go and talk Kayla Braxton. Hey, I'm interviewing superstars about their favorite WWE matches ever for a special on the bump, and I was wondering if we could chat. Sure, why not? Happy to help with all bump-related needs. So what's your favorite Justine match? Why do you assume my favorite match ever is a Justine match? Isn't it? Besides, it's much more fun for our viewers if you talk about your legend aunt. Gotcha. Well, if you insist on me talking about Justine... I do. Was there anyone you especially loved to see her take on? Actually, there was a match with Molly Holly from Raw I watched on repeat growing up. The crowd was on fire, the back and forth drama was insane, and Justine pulled off one hell of a victory. I'd love to interview you about it. Do you think you could remember what episode it aired on so I can pull some clips for the bump? I'll see what I can do. Well, here we go. Matt's from the past. We're going to unlock Molly Holly. And here comes Justine. And here we go. Here is Molly Holly. This guy's on the way. This Oh, what a kick to the face of Molly Holly. Now look at this. Molly Holly. Oh my god, what an elbow. Molly Holly. Molly Holly. Oh, now look at this. Choking Justine in the corner. Kick to the head. Nice whip in the corner. Look at the punches. We're stomping Molly Holly in the corner. Oh no. Oh, what a kick. And for the punches in the corner. Oh, they're stomping Molly Holly once again. Oh, what a shovel block by Molly Holly. Oh no. Oh no, looking for the busting crab. Oh, maybe not. A giant swing. S swing Justine across the ring. Oh, a kick to the back of Justine. Spin and back kick. Oh, that's Justine. Maybe thinking to go to the outside. Holy holy, Flyman's carry over her shoulders. Justine moving out of the way. Crucifix. Oh, kick out. So I shook to Molly Holly in the corner. There's the punches. Stumped her in the corner. Oh no. Maybe you 
on for his fix. Reversal again. Oh no, Justine. We're gonna stomp on Molly Holly. Justine is in trouble, but no, only a one count. Justine kick out. Molly Holly cannot believe it. We'll get up. There we go. Reversal. Oh no. Oh, snap me. Oh my god, that could be it. What a kick up by Justine. Drop kick. Here we go, getting Molly Holly up. Oh, she's in the corner. He's just bashing up with those punches. Oh no. Throwing it into the ring post. Shoulder first. On a running kick. Justine Jammer! Will that be it? And that's it. Here is your winner, Justine! Hey, I saw your interview on the bump with Kayla. Pretty wild to see those clips, too. I remember that victory fondly. I had a good time on the show. Kayla was pretty insistent that I talk about you. Eh, what can I say? I draw ratings. I was a little surprised you chose that match, though, for as resplendent as my win was. Really? It was good. Just not my personal favorite. What's yours? I'm not sure if there's just one, but it would be any match I had with China. Facing her with something really special. Honestly, I was probably a little jealous, which added some extra fire to my fight. Jealous? Of China? Why? Well, there was that whole period where management let China do basically whatever she wanted. Enter the Men's Royal Rumble, compete for the Intercontinental Championship. You know, stuff the guys always took for granted. Her IC title win was pretty epic. She was fierce against anyone she faced, myself included. In fact, for all my confidence, I was never sure when I was fighting her if I was going to come out on top. You know, I should probably get Kayla footage of one of my China matches. I'm sure she'll appreciate it. And introducing first, here is Just Stain. Let's bring in her opponent, who is China.
Let's get this match underway. section of China and guys remember like the video if you do want to see more of this content I am uh, trying to upload I alternate between videos of showcase and uh, my rise I'm focused on uploading the lock storyline as I am at the moment you wouldn't actually know that but after I upload the lock uh, storyline I will start uploading the um uh, Legacy storyline, which we're doing at the moment. And like video if you do want to see more. Oh, what a slam. Guillotine by Just Bane. She could be looking to choke at China. But no, it's not going to work. Stomping her. Well, trying to power slam on Justine. Power slam. With Justine. Could that be it? No kick out by China. But I don't know what Justine's looking for. She's looking to finish the match and she's going to be looking for that Justine Jammer. And yes, she is. She's looking for the Justine. Gemma, and she hits it on China. Could this be it? Could she get a victory? And there we go. Justine has defeated China. Here is your winner, Justine. There we go. Story complete. Maps from the past. Okay, who should we talk to now? Let's check our story progress. Let's talk to Sonia Deville. Hey, I'm, I'm, working, I'm working on something. On I don't know if you have any interest, but you do strike me as someone who's desperate to grow your fan base. Why are you always, always trying to cause trouble, trouble, Sonia? Somehow, I don't think whatever this is is something I want to be involved with. At least not with you. I'm I'm not being mean. Why do people keep thinking I'm trying to start something when I'm just trying to be nice? Sorry, it's just your wording, your attitude. To be honest, everything about you. Whatever. Look, we may be WWE superstars, but I want to give back by putting on a show specifically for up-and-coming talent. I'm working with LAW to set up some matches, raise some money for them, and maybe even mentor the next generation a little. That's a good thing, right? And I wanted to know if you were interested in getting involved and having a match there. That does sound like a good thing. Who am I fighting? And what's in it for you? I'd set you up against an indie wrestler, Geneva Rose. And maybe I just like helping people. Obviously, I need work on letting people see that side of me. So what do you say? Honestly, I'm still totally skeptical of your motives, but I'm on board for the next generation of wrestlers coming up. Not for you. 
great. I'll send over some paperwork for you to sign before your match, and then you can even deduct some stuff on your taxes, just like you do for charity. See you there. Wait, are you doing this for a tax break? Here we are at LAW. Here we go. And first, here comes Geneva Rose. And here comes Karen. Come on, let's go. Top rope. Oh, what a knee. Geneva Rose in big trouble. Has not go, uh, got no offense in yet. She's got to try and work on her defense, trying to get the strikes in. Oh, I say that. Oh, maybe not a reversal by Karen. Looking for the pin on Geneva Rose. Oh, kick out. Off the rope. Hip toss, handspring drop kick. Geneva Rose is in a lot of trouble Look for the hammerlock. DDT on Geneva Rose. Will that be it? And there we go, Karen has defeated Geneva Rose. Thanks for doing this. The crowd loved it. You're welcome. And I have to say, it looks like I was wrong about you. You put together a good event. That was surprisingly fun. LAW seems like a good place to grow talent. I'm glad to hear that, because you just earned yourself a match against Odyssey Rift for the LAW Championship. I'm not trying to win an LAW title. I came here for your event, that's all. Are you sure you don't want the match? I have to be honest, after getting a taste of being a WWE official, before it was unfairly taken away from me, I realized that I really like power. The power to broker matches for LAW? The power to run LAW and turn it into a legitimate rival of WWE. And this is the first step. I told you I was trying to raise money and support up and coming talent. That could be you. I'm happy on SmackDown. And I'm pretty sure you can't run LAW while under contract with WWE. Who knows? But I'm willing to bet WWE won't be happy if they find out you signed a full contract with LAW yourself. I didn't. <laughs> the only thing you didn't do was read that paperwork I sent over for you to sign. <laughs> That's fraud. Mm, sounds to me like breach of contract. Good luck enforcing that. I doubt I'll have to enforce anything. Once Odyssey Rift finds out you're refusing to face her. <laughs> I don't have time for this, Sonya. I did your event, and now I have to get back to SmackDown.
And there's one half of the tag team champions who's building a very impressive start to her career. Who is that? I think that's Odyssey Rift, but she's not signed with WWE. What's this all about? Unbelievable. A fight has just broken out backstage. Oh, this is extremely dangerous. Oh, great display of strength with the suplex. Uh-oh, this... Uh-oh. And came to their senses and realized a pin does no good here. Taken down to the mat. Running knee lift. Look at this. With a DDT. Oh. This is not going to be pretty. Not the. Uh oh. Odyssey retaliates. Uh oh. Uh oh. She saw that one coming. Brutal knee right to the face. Oh my god, but an Odyssey riff through that table. Ho <laughs> ho bullseye with the back fist. Oh, lights out. Rift was ready for that. My gosh! Oh man! Oh god! Oh man! Ooh! Ow! Oh my gosh! What impact! Oh my god! Oh my gosh! Just repeatedly beating her up with a chair. Oh, this is the punches to the back of Odyssey Rift. Oh my god, and look at that. Odyssey Rift is in huge trouble here. Eh? Oh, this reversal. Counters, this could be an opportunity. Let's take a trip to the Swiss Alps, shall we? Rick Bum! Moved at the right time. Running knee lift and attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. More attacks up there could leave her severely impaired. Legs caught. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. She's able to get out of the way. Look at these kicks and a what the hair and grabbing the hair too. Boom! Oh, perfect kick. Bam! And the attacks up there must be taking their toll. Her vision's got to be seeing some dark spots at this point. Continues to focus on that region of the body. Shirley is pinpointing that spot. Rip. Traps the arm into the hammer lock. DDT. Boom. And now it looks like they're done. You got a low boy knocking out. Is... Well, guys, hope you like the video. Like, comment, subscribe, turn on notifications, and I'll see you next video. So, bye, guys.